The Dubai World Cup is right around the corner, and that also means that fashionistas from around the country will be flocking to Maiden for the World Cup style stakes. In anticipation of the big event, Bergemont is hosting the International Millinery Exhibition, where hat and fascinator aficionados will have the opportunity to meet some of the most celebrated milliners from around the world and perhaps gain an edge on the competition ahead of the style stakes. What makes my hat stand out? Basically the designs. The designs are well thought of and they are very creative and dramatic. Um, like a slogan says, we want to make a woman look classy, want to make a woman look elegant and want to make a woman look dramatic at the races. We make pieces that will make all heads turn when the lady walks into the race. They're all handmade. I get the materials from all over the world. They could be um, a French straw cloth that are just flat like a roll of material and then um, I manipulate the material or block the material to get its shape and then it's stiffened, hardened and then I form my trims. Most of our designs are with feathers um, but we kind of pride ourselves on the quality of the finish. Everything's handmade, they're all bespoke so they're one-offs. Yeah, just they're unique and different, so. The inspiration for my uh, millinery work is mostly fashion icons from the past. It's hard not to be influenced by uh, classic movies. Um, movie stars from the past like Greta Garbo and Doris Day, I'm constantly referring to them in my work. I think all milliners are always uh, uh, referring to Jackie O, she's such an icon, and Audrey Hepburn, whether we um, we think we're uh, designing something new or not. I think we're always hinting on those people that we just love so much. Whether you want to make a show-stopping statement at the World Cup style stakes or opt for a more subtle accompaniment to your race attire, the exhibition, taking place until the 25th of March, is sure to have something to suit your style. Logan Fish for Tabloid. Thank you.